Welcome back to another video here, and we now have the long-awaited trailer to the third Deadpool movie release. Getting into this, keep in mind that this was a teaser trailer so we can expect more to come before it is released. But without further ado, let's jump into it. Ah! Wow, what a trailer. I was not expecting to see Wolverine and Deadpool together again, especially after the events of Logan. But I'm glad they are back because they have such a hilarious and dynamic chemistry. The trailer was full of jokes, action and surprises. I loved how Deadpool broke the fourth wall and called himself Marvel Jesus. I also enjoyed seeing the Time Variance Authority and how they recruited Deadpool to be a hero of the multiverse. I wonder what kind of adventures and challenges he will face in different timelines and realities. I'm also curious about the other characters and cameos that will appear in the movie, such as Emma Corrin, Matthew McFadden, and Jennifer Garner. The trailer definitely got me hyped for the movie, which is coming out on July 26th. I can't wait to see it. God, I love this part. Wait! Now that the initial reaction is out of the way, let's look a little more into the trailer. In the opening scene, we see Wade celebrating his birthday with a number of familiar faces that we see in the other two movies. We see characters like Shatterstar, Peter Blind, Al Dupinder, Colossus, Negasonic Teenage Warhead, Buck Yuko, and finally, Vanessa. Now, following his birthday celebration, we see our first look at the TVA, which you may recall from the Marvel Loki series and our first fourth wall break in the teaser. The TVA then kidnap Deadpool and is placed in front of a new character in the TVA. This new character is in the teaser and it is to be believed that this is the Marvel character, Paradox. This new character proceeds to explain that Deadpool is special and eventually presents him footage of the MCU Avengers. This leads into a dialogue from Deadpool walking through different scenes explaining that the cinematic universe is about to change forever. Through these scenes we can see the back of what looks to be Charles Xavier aka Professor X. Next he walks to a poker table where we can see the back of Wolverine who is wearing a white suit with his iconic hairstyle. After those cameos we come back to a conversation between Paradox and Deadpool where he claims to be Marvel Jesus. So what could this mean for the plot of the movie? Will Deadpool help save the multiverse? Leave your thoughts in the comments below. Whoa, 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 whoa. Is that supposed to be scary? Pegging isn't new for me, friendo, but it is for Disney. After the claim of being Marvel Jesus, we see someone suit up Deadpool in his new suit for the movie. And after the suit up scene, we see a montage of Deadpool in action in various places. If you look closely, you can see that Deadpool is standing in front of the now-retired Fox Century movie logo, which is a fun little Easter egg from Deadpool's movie history. In addition, this scene does look very similar to the void we see in Loki, but what do you think? Do you think there could be some other reminiscences from other universes in this scene? But this scene is followed by a few more action-packed scenes, which eventually leads up to seeing Deadpool knock to the ground and then see the first live action look at the original Wolverine suit. This is followed up with the current title of the movie, which could still change. <sighs> Mr. Wilson, you appear to have soiled yourself while unconscious. I wasn't unconscious. Who are you? Now, before finishing this, there was one more Easter egg in this trailer that is easy to miss. At the end, where Deadpool lays on the ground, to the right of him, there is a ripped up comic. If you zoom in just enough, you can see that it is a Secret Wars comic. Could this be a tease to what is to come? Will Secret Wars happen? Leave your thoughts in the comments below. Don't just stand there, you ape. Give me a hand up. Nope. I'm actually okay, thank you very much. So, in the end, was the teaser enough, or do you need more? Be sure to subscribe if you are excited to see the full trailer in the near future. Finally, we want to say thank you for watching, and if you did enjoy this, please watch another, and be sure to leave a like.